BBC News. Now, the iPad 2 might be the latest must-have gadget, but some people appear to be going to extraordinary lengths to get one. The media in China are reporting that one teenager has sold one of his kidneys to raise the money. One TV station claims to have interviewed the boy in question. Here's Jonathan Josephs. The 17-year-old, identified only as little Zhuang, shows his scar to a local TV reporter. A kidney, it seems, is the cost of the latest must-have technology in China. To buy an iPad and a laptop computer, the teenager apparently volunteered his organ in exchange for 22,000 won, about 3,500 US dollars. He tried to hide what he'd done from his shocked mother. When my son came home, he had a laptop computer and an Apple phone. I asked him where all the money for that came from. When he couldn't keep it to himself for any longer, he finally told us. He said, Mum, I sold my kidney. When he told me, I felt like the sky was crashing down on our family. The reported transaction was arranged online after little Zhang responded to an advert. It's a case which highlights China's black market in organ trafficking. One broker told a Chinese TV station how it works. We pay the same price across the whole country, 35,000 won plus the bonus, which is between two and 10,000. It makes the selling of organs an attractive option for China's poor. Organ trafficking remains a flourishing trade, despite the risks of such operations and a ban that was implemented four years ago. China's shortage of legitimate donors means that if little Zhang's alarming story is true, he's unlikely to be the last to swap an organ for cash. Jonathan Josephs, BBC News. In Russia, 28,000 people have been...